Hello, hello, hello. Good evening, everybody. Is my microphone working? Is anything working? I think I'm good. No, it's not working. Right. <laughs> Thank you, Thomas. <laughs> and Rink in the chat. Good to see you guys. Um, I regretted this already. <laughs> I've it's been. I, I actually had to keep having a rest and a break while setting up this stream. Uh, this this ride, moving everything around so I could fit my bike in amongst all my other stuff. Um, I had to bring my aircon unit back in from the bedroom. Uh, thank you, Rink. Yeah, he spotted the haircut. That's a DIY job. It's not actually a good haircut at all. Uh, the camera is obviously, yeah, the camera's obviously making it look a little bit better than it actually is. Um, but yeah, I've, I basically had to have a break every 10 minutes to sit down after moving my rig, my monitors, my aircon, all the other bits and bobs that go into uh, what, well, what seems to be just doing a Zwift race and trying to stream it. Um, I've decided to jump in on a ZHR Hare and Hounds race rather than just turn it on and ride with no set agenda. Uh, oh, this is cool. I've never seen this before. We've got C and D on our jerseys. This is all really good. I'm, I'm so out of touch with Zwift, obviously, that I'm, I don't actually know how this race works either, whether I'm supposed to work with the team or what but they're going to be bitterly disappointed if they're expecting any help um, but yeah every, everything on Zwift is new to me this is so bizarre uh, but <clears throat> best way to learn jump in suck it and see yeah all the new fonts are nice actually Thomas I noticed that on their logo I didn't realize they changed the font on everything the whole interface it looks really good I'm surprised they didn't do that when they did the logo change the first time around, if I'm honest, because it's much more befitting of that style than the previous one was, but they got there in the end, it looks good. Um, <clears throat> anyway, 30 seconds until the race starts, I've had to charge my ETAP, my power meter, my heart rate monitor, and what else did I have to do? Oh, my shoes barely fit anymore. I think I've put on as much weight in my feet as I have everywhere else. Um, oh, you can't see that timer. Oh, I've got 10 seconds. Yeah, the camera's in the way. Well, you can probably hear the beep now, anyway. Right, I'm going to not talk for, well, probably about 15 seconds. But here we go. Good luck, everyone. Let's do this. All right, I'm moving, anyway. Not very fast. Did I just say I wasn't going to talk? I'm pretty sure I did. <clears throat> Thank you, Rink. Thirty-seven kilometers. There's no way I'm completing the entire event. I have put my correct weight in, by the way. <laughs> That's just mean, Thomas. <laughs> Slightly elderly, yeah. Hey, I'm 48 now. I think that qualifies me as slightly elderly. I'll tell you what is depressing, is my weight in kilograms is exactly double my age. Hence the need to start doing something about it. Oh good, we're not going up the mountain. <laughs> I think this is Volcano Flat times three. How flat that is, I can't remember. I'm hoping very. <clears throat> oh, you're having problems with the eye racing. Oh dear. Update a photo from 2018. What, do you need like photo ID or something now? <sighs> 
So the point of streaming this was really just as a test stream because we have the WTRL Zwift League starting on Saturday and I'd like to stream the races from that if I can and uh, that in itself will be a test stream or test series of the WKG League which believe it or not I have actually started on the schedule uh, with a view to starting mid-October thank you Ko Koe Ishii for the ride on <coughs> yeah a view to starting mid-October um, now I'm not going to give you any more details on that for now because it will inevitably change a lot before I publish it. So with me I've got E. Nealon, Nealon, J. Saunders just behind, 9 seconds, S. Le Hayerek at 28 seconds. Uh, looks like some of the bees are on their way now. And then the bunch that got away, well, there's C. Hamilton, 35 up the road, then a trio, Gorse, Sim, and Badox, Badoxi at 29 seconds. <coughs> Rink, if you're still watching, I have to thank you once again for getting this working for me. Um, it's still a strange way that I have to launch it because every time Zwift do an update I just get exactly the same problem so I'm having to basically delete everything reinstall let it do that slow update that never actually completes but fails and then drag all the files from the download folder into the documents the Zwift folder in documents and then launch from the EXE from in there where I still get an error message saying it can't can't run because another version's running and it can't update but then it just launches so if it gets me on the road I don't really care how I get there oh my word this is 2.4k in <laughs> I, I couldn't find one of my headbands sweatbands so this is going to be this is going to be ugly I noticed um, Paul Trilk was going to do the the mini crit tonight <clears throat> unfortunately I'm not around at that time but uh, I would have loved to have done that as my first sort of test run back not that I'd have lasted more than the quick sprint out of the gate and then that would have been it but it would have been nice to join some other WKG guys and girls So I've adjusted my weight in Zwift. I've put my FTP at 150, which I think is probably still optimistic. <coughs> Given that I'm doing 1.2 watts per kilogram at 172 beats per minute <laughs> on my heart. So, hey, hey Shanti, how you doing, man? I'm not going fast enough to tax the GPU now. This game will never crash the GPU. <laughs> it's got all the time in the world to process the information that it's having to transmit. <laughs> hey Mr. Mike, how you doing bud? Thank you buddy, you know what, I'm 3k in, breathing like a asthmatic, the, the chubby asthmatic that I am, but actually still loving the fact that I'm doing this, I'll be honest with you, I feel quite proud of myself, and I've eaten really healthily today as well, and I'm hoping the two will encourage each other, exercise encourage me to eat healthy, Eating healthy will encourage me to keep up the exercise. <clears throat> Stream looks good. Oh, cool. It was a very rushed overlay. Because I don't have anything that fits around the Zwift interface. Um, but, as I mentioned earlier, this is a, a bit of a test stream. So I can watch this back and uh, fine-tune all of that. Alex is now following... Yay! Hey. Thank you, Dane Alex. Thanks for the follow, dude. Good to have you here. <clears throat> yeah, so the proper streams should start on Saturday with the first Swift Racing League race. 
Uh, Neelan has just dumped me on that climb. Surprise, surprise. Um, so yeah, I'll try and fine tune the old, uh, cheers dude. Oh my God, my mouse is so impossible to use over here, quick. Oh, he's disappeared. Oh, I wanted to do it before. His one disappeared. Oh my God, this is hard. Yeah, done it. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, so, actually I don't know what time that race is on Saturday. <clears throat> but that'll be the first proper Zwift stream, I think, for a long time. Long, long time. <laughs> Bugger off, is it 7am? 7am <laughs> starts as reserved for 24 hour sim races. I think I need to oil my chain and cassette. That's one part of the preparation I forgot today. Oh, Thomas has got himself into iRacing for the electric portion, a new track, nice. I do, I, I, actually I'd say, I'd say I'd do a 24 hour Zwift session. I'm trying to think how that would work. How you could uh, set that up as a, like a relay race. I think that'd be amazing against other teams. Oh, sweat dripping in my eyes. I've heard that, Mike. I think that was one of the first things that a lot of people were saying to me, is a magnesium deficiency. Uh, I did take supplements for a while, and I can't remember. It's funny, there were a couple of things I tried that seemed to work for a bit and then not. And every time, it's a bit like with my computer breaking. Every time I thought I had it solved, something else happened and uh, I cramped up. Like the 25 hour thing. Is there a 25 hour Zwift race? I didn't even think about cramp actually, Mike. <laughs> I was just thinking my lungs are gonna explode. But yeah, it'll be interesting to see which comes first. Oh, the real life thing. Oh, yeah, like the one at um, Brands Hatch. <laughs> yeah, I went and saw them, didn't I? Yeah, at Brands. Was that 25 hours, was it? Cool, I wasn't paying attention. But yeah, it was with one of teams of, I don't know, a restricted number, so say eight riders or something like that. And uh, I don't know how you'd, you'd monitor it, but you, you do it like a relay. Oh, is that what it was? The clock changing. <laughs> we came so close to arranging one of those and then the whole event was cancelled. Uh, not being funny, but I've done just about to tick on five kilometers. That's five kilometers more than I expect you to do. I know, I know I'm only doing like one and a half watts per kilogram, but this is, uh, this is hard work, as evidenced by my heart rate. Thank you, M. Graf, for the ride on. Mike's leg, leg cramps usually come after a ride when seating on the couch or while sleeping, yeah. Well, mine come during. Um, but if I finish a race without getting them, I never assume that, that I've got away with it because yeah, later in the evening or whatever, there's always still that chance of things seizing up. Thank you, Thomas. I think that's the most complimentary thing you've ever said to me. <laughs> And thank you, Peter, I saw, just gave me a ride on. Peter Futurko. And uh, 
someone else did just before that, which I missed, sorry. Can I finish in 20 minutes? No, but I might well be finished in 20 minutes. <coughs> Dane Alex, I tried different things for leg cramps back when I did CrossFit for a little. Ne never figured it out in mine. <laughs> I'm in the same boat, dude. Tried everything. I did pickle juice, apple cider vinegar in my drinks. Um, I think there was one drink for a while where I was convinced it was doing the job. It was basically making, uh, basically using a, a standard sort of electrolyte tablet to mix the drink. And then there's some real, fru uh, real fruit uh, juice, salt, vinegar, uh, ginger. I don't know why I keep looking down for the cameras. It's up there, isn't it? Uh, yeah. And I was convinced that was working for a while, but at the same time, I think I was probably just doing more consistent riding then as well. <coughs> Velo Viking behind me on the board. Oh, I haven't seen him. Oh, I hope he is there. I'm assuming, well, he'll be at a C. So, yeah, he might be part of that bunch that will come flying through at some point. More viewers than I get on my rally streams. Yeah, <laughs> we're into double figures. Woohoo! <laughs> you might be right, Thomas. I think this is one of the races he does. <sighs> Clampy! The Clampy. The underscore Clampy is now following. Yeah, boy. <laughs> Great to see you, mate. Thanks for the follow. As I've mentioned, I, I'm really, really hoping, and I promise I will do my best to make this a regular thing now. I need it big time. And I miss all you guys. These are names I haven't spoken too much in years. So for me, as much as the need for exercise, it's, uh, it's just a way of getting back in touch with everybody. Just superb. Oh, I said, I've got to go over this little bump and this, this isn't very pleasant. I know about the mini crit, Darren. <laughs> it's too late for me. It doesn't start till five to eight. And I'm not available at that time. Go on then, Thomas, what did you do on Monday? I don't want to guess. E evening, Clampy. <laughs> How are you, my friend? Anyway, how's life treating you? The last I saw of you was a photo I think you put up. Yourself and your missus. I think you were at a wedding or something. And without wanting to blow too much smoke up your backside, you were looking like a very fine figure of a man. Look like you've been doing some working out. Either that or it was your your younger brother that you posted a picture of. What the hell are Imsim Talentos? I'm gonna guess the pedals, are they? Wow. Nice one man. That's you done for your, your sim spending. <laughs> Nice. I think those are the ones you sent me a link to. They look pretty impressive. Hydraulic, I believe. Oh. <laughs> yeah, to be fair, I think you were standing behind your wife, so I couldn't actually see you. <laughs> no, seriously. You looked, you looked very well, mate. <clears throat> yes, ring, do it. <laughs> <laughs> I think everyone should have to stream and have a camera right in their face while they're riding. <clears throat> yeah, I think I'm done with the sim spending for a while as well, uh, Thomas. Although I very much have my eye on a, a particular upgrade 
in the steering wheel department. Oh, I missed a message there. Who was that? Oh, oh dear, this is impossible. Uh, Dane Alex just ordered a spin bike. Oh, it's moved again. Oh. Why don't I just stretch this down? Hang on. This will be better. There we go. Dane Alex just ordered a spin bike to try out Zwift. Seems a lot more intense of a workout than I thought it'd be. It's always harder than you imagine because it's constant. If you think of outdoor riding, whether you're conscious of it or not, there's a lot more coasting. Zwift there isn't. And obviously you've got no airflow. I've got a big fan down there, but you haven't got the real airflow to help. Uh, Clampy did his first race in over a year today to try and get into the WTRL league. One more to go. Do we need to do qualifying races or something? Or is that just for your own preparation? Uh, Thomas, if I do that, I need to ride in something completely green so I can mask it out in OBS. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like a, an all green morph suit or something. You can just see your eyes. <laughs> Thank you, Rink. I'm nearly at 10k and that, I'll be honest, at the start of this, uh, 10k was like a, a stretch goal. I wasn't sure I could do that. Clampy's legs don't like him at the moment. <laughs> I'm not surprised. Mine are going to hate me when I get off this thing. So is my arse. That's the thing I really forgot about. <laughs> the boy's good. Hey, Martin. <laughs> I started singing that song the other night and I couldn't work out why it was in my head. The, um, uh, what is it, the children? Uh, children are the future, that one. I started singing it, couldn't work out why, and then I remembered <laughs> it was you. Uh, <laughs> don't go this fast, yeah, look at that. 26 kph, <laughs> 1.3 watts per kilogram. On Clampy's last trip, the way he was using a watt bike atom in the gym. Oh, wow. That's brilliant. If you can manage to do that while you're away. I like the experience of a smart bike. It just wasn't as smooth as your kicker. All right, so we need two races in the last 12 months to get your category for entry. Okay. I must have done two in the last 12, surely. I did at least two in last year's Winter League. That's it, Martin. I believe the children are the future. <laughs> yeah, I shouldn't sing and ride. That's definitely not good for my heart rate. I got the old uh, salbutamol. I'm loaded up on it already, but it's there when I inevitably collapse. Have we seen the seas? Oh, here they come now, five seconds. So yeah, let's see if uh, Velo Viking is in this gang. I think the main bunch of Ds could stay away. They're five minutes ahead of me. There they go. Is there a Velo Viking in there? I didn't see him. Maybe he's dropped off that bunch. Oh, up we go again. He was there, was he? And Pato as well. I'm pretty sure it's Patrick. Um, oh, I can't remember which Patrick. But I think he's one of our guys. This is one of the first races I ever did. And where this probably is where my rivalry with Kev Stephen was born. Doing the hare and hounds. Oh. I'd have had an email telling me if I needed it. Okay, brilliant, I've not had an email. Assuming they're not bothered about how fast, how fast I was in those races then. <laughs> they still qualified. Let's go and see if we can find Vela Viking. Yeah. 
my oh there's Hatto. I have to stop pedaling to use my mouse. Hey, right, there he is. Snorepoli, I'm back. Hey, there he is. Bang in the middle of this bunch, good man. Yeah, it was at a time when Kevin and I were much more evenly matched. And we used to do these hare and hounds. Believe it or not, I think I beat him on a climb up the original epic com in one of these. And since that day, I assume he used that as motivation to never be beaten by me ever again, because I'm pretty sure I'd have rubbed it in big time. And true enough, I don't think I've ever beaten him at anything since. <laughs> don't overdo it on your first ride on Zwift you will pay for it tomorrow you're absolutely right Mike I'm, uh, I'm kind of riding within myself at the moment don't be fooled by the numbers on the screen those are, <laughs> those are snorephalies <laughs> what blue flag said yes you're right I'm not going to overdo it um, I've done 11.1k I'm pleased with that so I'll just keep churning for a little while and then go and collapse and lie down somewhere. What I need to try and resist is a beer straight after this. <sighs> I can't remember it ever really working for me, uh, Mike. The the pickle juice. I, like I say, I mixed it with uh, electrolyte drink. But I think it's something to do actually with the bitterness. So it's not the ingredients once you've sort of got it in your system. If I'm right, I think it's something to do with the sort of shock of the bitterness um, that actually, <laughs> I don't know if it distracts your body from the cramp or what. Uh, but I think I was using it wrong by mixing it in the nice fruity drink. All right, let's go, let's go back to me. Well done, Velo. Looking strong, man. Yeah, oh, I know. I was saying, I found two unopened large leffes in my fridge, which I hadn't drank from my birthday. Yeah, I think that's what you're meant to do, Mike. I think you take it like a shot. And I think it's supposed to, it's that kind of instant sour jolt. Thank you, Jay Anderson, for the ride on. Um, that actually does you some good. <laughs> yes, yeah, those big pickle companies. <laughs> like spinning a, a yarn again. I think what I did after trying the pickle juice is I then convinced myself that it would be exactly the same thing to have a Big Mac with uh, gherkins in it. So I, I tried using those as well. Didn't, didn't work. <laughs> uh, I've got, oh that was the last of the C's. Yeah, I think so, Rink. It's Patrick. I can't remember which Patrick it is, what his surname is. Say, surname is. Yeah, let's give him a... I gave him a ride on, didn't I? Let's watch him for a second, anyway. <clears throat> Pato Award. <laughs> it's definitely not him. <laughs> yeah. I think he was uh, half expecting to take the uh, 
the other McLaren seat before all the Piastri stuff started. Yeah. He's not doing that great in the iRacing though. Uh, sorry, not iRacing, IndyCar. Every time I see him, he's uh, five seconds away from a crash. And uh, inevitably, he does something in most races that take him out of what should be a promising finish. Oh, of course, Mike. I forgot. Just coming up to one o'clock at your end. Go and have a nice lunch, my friend. Oh, yeah, that's what will happen. I'll go to hit the brake in a sim race and just cramp up. I think I'm going to get finger cramps as well, gripping onto these bars. <laughs> yeah, you're right, Darren. <laughs> uh, I've Obviously, I've been a Ferrari fan since uh, as long as I can remember when I got into F1. Even pre sort of Jean Alessi and Gerhard Berger days, although those were the guys that really got me into them. And I, this is the closest I've ever been to just giving up on them completely. You just know it's going to happen every race. Something is going to happen in a very comical way that just destroys the, the outcome for their drivers. Not that the drivers are completely blameless, but on a lot of occasions they are. Am I right in thinking you can go over level 50 now on this? I think they've finally added some levels. <laughs> Only an hour to go. So I did, that's one lap and the leading. <laughs> uh, I think I'll try and get to 15K and then I'm probably done. I know that's really pathetic, 30 minutes of riding. Hey, Helena. Thank you very much for the ride on. Good to see you. Yeah, I haven't got another full lap in me, I can tell you that much. So, I'll round it off to a nice 15K. Consider that money in the bank. Have a nice warm shower. And then try and do some stretching or something to try and minimize any discomfort for tomorrow. And then hopefully I'll jump back on tomorrow. Tim Apple time. I'll mute you in case something exciting happens, like an ambulance arrives. <laughs> I like a woman in uniform. <laughs> All right, go and enjoy. I'll be done in a few minutes anyway, Darren, I should imagine. What's the announcing anyway? iPhone 14? Fourteen plus other bits. <clears throat> I do. I, I always forget when they're on, but the ones I have watched, I do actually quite enjoy. Thank you, mate. I appreciate that. It's. Um, I'm just hoping it triggers some enjoyment and desire to carry on <laughs> so I keep it's such a stuttered start thank you see Morton for the ride on good to see you yeah so it's been so stop start I just gotta, gotta find something that makes me keep coming back for more and I'm hoping this league that starts on Saturday will be it Hey, off! <laughs> yeah, you're right. <laughs> this is certainly faster than, than my recent rally streams. How you doing, Keith? I missed your stream last night, Keith. I'm gonna have to watch the video of that when I get a chance. Evelyn Nairs! Great to see you, mate. Thank you for the ride on. I've got about as many wheels left as I tend to have on my rally streams as well. 
Just came back, arse hurting soon. Oh, it's, oh mate, it's hurting already. Yes. It hurt just getting on the bike. It's actually painting my shoulders and my wrists that I'm really feeling because I'm leaning on the bars. Maybe I need to adjust my position slightly to compensate for my new body shape. Right, I'm just going to spin up to 15k and then I think I should stop. <laughs> yeah, I suppose you can fit any seat you like when you're riding indoors, can't you? I need some kind of bean bag. Rob Carbonay, great to see you my man, thank you for the ride on. And Mr D, <laughs> thank you Keith. I feel bad, I was, I had Zwift on for about three hours earlier today just while I was trying to set things up, check everything was working. And I got more ride ons then. <laughs> Than I've had during this ride. I didn't turn a wheel. <laughs> Last hundred meters. I'm definitely feeling it in my in my lungs, so I'm not gonna push myself beyond that. There we go. Alright. Oh I'm really glad I did that. And glad I streamed it because it was great chatting with you lot. Such a brilliant distraction as much as anything else. Percy, my man. Thank you, buddy. Good to see you. Um, yeah, as I mentioned earlier, some names that I've not chatted to for a long time. So that was really, really nice. I really appreciate it. Uh, but I shall end this stream now and uh, try and get myself freshened up. Thank you, jeans, GNs. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, actually, feeling cramped getting off the bike. Yeah, there we go. There it is. <laughs> um, yeah, thank you all so much for watching and for chatting. And uh, like I say, I, I, I'm not sure what time it is, but I will, um, I will find out and put a post up. I'm going to try and stream the the ZRL races from Saturday. They're every Saturday for the next six weeks, I believe. Um, which will take us nicely into the WKG League, which I've been working on the schedule, but nothing finalised yet, so I won't reveal anything until I until I know it works. Um, and I hope to see a lot of you there, and I hope that I can uh, stay there <laughs> for the, the distance. Same course every week. I don't think it is, is it? Surely not. Um, Yeah, do you need to do two races? Oh no, you must have done plenty of races, Keith, to qualify. You must be fine. Uh, Keith, the mini crit's on at 7.55 tonight, if you fancy that one. Sadly, I can't, otherwise obviously I would, definitely. <laughs> uh, back on the bike, up the little hill. I've done enough little hills, I'm done. <laughs> right, that's it, I'm signing off. Thank you everyone, have a good evening, afternoon. Mike, I hope you enjoyed your lunch, um, and I'll uh, I'll see you all on Saturday, if not before. Au revoir. <laughs>